A journey of a thousand miles begins with a step. Always honored to be addressed a nurse, to reflect on our legacy, its deep roots and profound impact. This is a picture of the Crimean War. In October 1853, the British Empire was at war with the Russian Empire and by 1854, no fewer than 18,000 soldiers were admitted into the military hospitals and the death tolls kept increasing due to the appalling unsanitary and inhumane conditions. Not until a nurse understood that hygienic practices can save lives, she dispensed endless comfort and so some called her the Angel of Crimea and others addressed her the Lady with the Lamp. Since then, at different points in time, the human race have been facing n number of pandemic. The smallpox, Spanish flu, the Justinian plague, HIV, AIDS, swine flu, yellow fever, the novel coronavirus, Ebola, MERS, SARS and so on. The cholera epidemic of 1832, this began when an immigrant ship landed at Quebec with cases of Asiatic cholera, devastating many. The influenza virus, which spread worldwide in 1918 and 19, and I tell you 50 million people, that is almost one third of the world population, was infected with this virus. The era of another deadly disease, the Western African Ebola virus 2013-16, was another major plague causing major loss of life and socio-economic disruption. Tribute to 31-year-old nurse and mother of two, this is Lini Pudasheri from Kerala who died treating the Nipah virus and this is one more stark reminder of the deadly battles fought by our nurses. And then stood by our doorstep at the dusk of 2019, the novel coronavirus from Wuhan. Every time when the world faces a health crisis like this, a nurse steps in. And needless to say, it always takes a strong, intelligent and compassionate person to take up the ills of the whole world, work with passion and purpose to maintain the health and well-being of the planet. And that is a nurse. We must understand that nurses face the challenges in keeping their charges also keeping themselves safe on a COVID-19 repatriation flight in the hospitals and in the ICUs, providing antenatal care, elderly care, psychological support in the context of COVID-19. And for one nurse who gets quarantined after caring for her patients who are tested positive for the virus, she definitely undergoes a paramount of stress and fear. That being the fact, Nurses still lead the army of healthcare and are trained to deal with situations like this. Once a nurse, always a nurse. The global nurse family unites here today to tell you what and how they feel to be called and addressed a nurse. To do things that nobody else will do, in a way that nobody else can do, in spite of all that we go through. That is to be a nurse, a person who can inspire lives and at the same time who can be inspired by many lives. We are multi-talented healthcare providers. We are the salt and light. As nurses, we practice the art of healing and the miracle of hope. We touch human lives. 
according to me a nurse is a mother a father a friend a brother a sister a counselor a guide we care for patients with compassionate heart and pray that every touch becomes a healing touch pulling through is not only about getting the right medical solutions it is also about being cared for compassionately nurses give their patients exactly that and that's probably the reason nurses should be called as blessing of humanity a nurse means when you sit with a person and you hold their hand you're telling them that you're there for them it means putting yourself out there for others and learning how to put others before you and it means having determination but at the same time learning how to have compassion we are strong enough to tolerate anything and soft enough to understand anyone we are there when you're born when you're sick when you can't meet your needs when you're distressed and during your last days patients may forget our name but they will never forget how we made them feel that is who a nurse is a journey of 1000 miles begins with a step a step when you decide to dedicate yourself for the service of others and that's exactly what nurses do this video is a tribute to many compassionate and excellent nurses who have rose up to work beyond the call in different parts of the world and that has definitely made a difference to the human race thank you